What's going on, everybody? It's your boy BJ coming at you with another video. Oh, this is a little. There we go. I hope you guys are all having a fantastic day. Um, it is um, a beautiful day in the Bay, as usual. Um, thank you guys so much for coming to the channel. I uh, really do appreciate your viewership. It really does mean so much to me that you spend just several minutes of your time. Hit the like button. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this video. I want to talk to you guys today about being the star in your own movie. I've had videos like this before where I talk to you guys and um, some people still have questions say, well, BJ, how do you be the star in your own movie? Well, it's basically just focusing on yourself, being the best version of yourself possible. That's through fitness, through, you know, your love and relationships, your self-appreciation, uh, keeping your spirituality right, and also uh, in your finances as well. We got people that are always so busy focused on other things that serve them no purpose. You know, you're focused on another person or uh, you're worried that somebody didn't text you back or you're worried that somebody didn't call you back yet or whatever it is. There's so many things that people are worried about that they shouldn't be worried about because if you focus on you, you basically raise your vibration and your energy. And when you do this, you become more magnetic. You draw people to you, you draw opportunities to you, you draw uh, just divine connections. They start to come to you. And I know it sounds like, some people might say it sounds like woo woo or whatever you think it is, but it's really not. It's, it's all about vibration because every single one of us is really energy. If you were to put your hand under a microscope, you would see that you vibrate energy. That's really what we are is energy. So when you vibrate energy, you're basically pulling things to you that is, you know, miraculous, uh, di divine uh, connections, you know, blessings, uh, miracles. Um, it could be just things that are good for your good because you're focused on that. And when you become the star in your own movie and you focus on your growth and your well-being, you don't have time to worry about what's going on in somebody else's movie, so to speak. Because when you do that, you become a cameo in somebody else's movie. Somebody else is being a star in their movie and then you become a cameo in their movie. You don't want to be a cameo in somebody else's movie. You want to be the star in your own movie. When you watch a movie, you don't care about the cameo people, right? The people that make a cameo appearance or the extras, they're there as fillers. So when you become a cameo in somebody's movie or you're always trying to be in somebody else's movie, then you then you become a cameo in their movie. And guess what? If you treat someone like they're the star, they're gonna treat you like you're a fan. So in order for you to draw people to you, you have to be the star. That's who everyone's focused on. What's gonna happen with the star? What's gonna happen with the main character of this movie or this TV show or whatever it is? Because people wanna know what the star is gonna do. People wanna get close to the star. People wanna be around the star. This has nothing to do with arrogance or cockiness. This has to do with the self-love and confidence and appreciation for yourself. And when you have a self-love and appreciation for yourself, people are drawn to you magnetically. You draw good things to you. You draw divine synchronicities to you. And amazing things start to show up and happen for you in your life because you're focused on your well-being and your growth. It's not that you don't care about anybody else or you think that you're better than anybody else, but you know your worth. You know that you're special. You know that you're a prize. You know that you are the one. And you're not focused on somebody else and putting somebody else on a pedestal and saying, oh my God, I want to date this person. I need, I need this person in my life. I just need to date them. No, you know that you're the star. You know that you're the one. You know that you're the king or the queen or whatever it is. So that people desire to be around you. And like I said, this is a confidence. This is not arrogance. This is knowing who you are and knowing that you're worth it. You're worthy of the love you desire. You're worthy of the abundance of the love, of the happiness, the joy, the respect. You're worthy of it all. And when you give yourself that love, it vibrates out and it pulls good things to you to match your vibration. So other people can see that and feel that. So... Remember to be the star. Be the star in your own movie and you will attract miraculous blessings and synchronicities into your life. Give it a try and see what happens. Be the star in your movie and watch the amazing things that happen in your life. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. It really does mean a lot to me. Give this video a thumbs up uh, if you haven't already. 
uh, subscribe to the channel. Uh, that way you can be a part of my subscription list. And you know what it is, guys. Come on. You got to make sure you hit that bell icon. That way you won't miss a video that I upload to this channel. That way you get deemed and you know that I'm uploading something because YouTube won't know. Oh my God, what the heck is that? Sorry about that. <laughs> YouTube won't notify you unless uh, you hit the bell icon so that you, um, they won't notify you. Even if you're subscribed to me, they won't notify you unless you hit the bell icon. So I'll put some other videos up here for you to go ahead and check out. And as usual, I love you guys. God bless you. And I'll see you in the next post. Peace.